thoughts on sin nombre or without name. I thought it was a good twist. I was very surprised. In general, the film surprises you quite a bit, killing off characters that you kind of expect maybe to make it. When Smiley shot Casper, yeah. And However, I'm not entirely sure that we saw enough of why he prefers the gang. I mean, he himself insisted on getting another chance to kill him to prove his loyalty to the gang. It must be the macho thing, because he shows off the pistol, you know, he gets his own pistol, and then he starts showing it off to, you know, those other boys. And we do see him, you know, at that one party, and maybe he does kind of enjoy that. I don't know, it was very brief for what's more or less a main character. I mean, you know, another character that betrays is, you know, the the woman who Casper used to deliver for, you know. She can always get another delivery boy, but if the gang has a problem with her, yeah, she might get killed. They're at the very end where they find him. I guess they were just checking the various areas where you could cross the water. That is my only guess for how they could find him right there. I really had expected that they would find him in, find the two of them in the car, but yeah, and where they wake up and it seems like something's written on the front window of the car, I thought that that was them sending a message, but whatever. For anyone who is wondering, because I noticed that on the IMDb boards some people were, yes, Smiley shot Casper. He pulls the trigger a couple of times and you see the blood, you know, starting to appear on the back of Willie's shirt before the gang members come over and shoot him. I'm, I think he's already on the ground by then. It went by so fast, so I'm not entirely sure what was it that caused, I guess, the uncle, I think it was, to fall off the train. I mean, I'm not saying it was a uh, bad, you know, it fit with the whole, you know, the whole film is a tragedy, so of course he dies and, you know, the other one gets deported. I'm just not entirely sure if he was trying to make the jump between the two cars, if he ran too fast, couldn't stop in time, anyway. The very conclusion is quite relieving you know, finally a victory for this poor girl, you know. Maybe it's just me, but I didn't really think the humor necessarily worked. Maybe some of the time, but... I don't know, I'm not entirely sure if it was... It was maybe the timing that was off, I would say. And... I suppose that's about what there is to say about it, so those are my thoughts on Sinombra without a name.